what do you do y'all welcome to the crypto channel 329 let's go for another pot corruptions video like i said to y'all on the signals channel 329 i'm gonna start sending some signals if i find some really good opportunities all right guys so the daily target is that today is uh, 9.33 or 195 all right so i would love to reach 200 today okay but if you reach 195 and if i see the market is not great i will just wrap it up all right so let's go and um, let's look for our first opportunity so stay tuned into the channel because as soon as i find that something is going to happen i will then say hey go stay stay tuned in for this one because you might go higher or it might go lower okay so let's go okay guys so i just sent this signal out into the tg so let me just send a screenshot with my entry hold on okay as you can see right here this is my first trade i decided to place two minutes trades on this one because uh, this one is a bit slow the candles are a bit weak but if we zoom out a little bit we can see that we are on this pattern right here and um, it's going down all right so i believe the price came over here or potentially i placed the trade too early because uh, potentially might come over here to this line but it's not sure of at the same time we reach the overbought level okay that's why i decided to place a trade but it seems like it was too early also the the volume was getting weak we saw some red bars over here so i decided to place the trade but seems like it was a bit too early so in that case um i'm gonna hold on to it a little bit longer to see what's gonna happen because we can see the volume is is now increasing so this trade most likely is going to be a loss and um, yeah we will have to wait for the next opportunity okay in the meantime i'm on the lookout for um where is it gpy okay this one i thought it would go down because we could see the volume was decreasing oh it's gpy jpy so yeah it makes sense so the volume was decreasing i was also on the lookout for this one but you know is pumping right now so it's not a good time to enter so we lost the first trade so let's continue the trading session let's look for the next opportunity okay we are we are in again uh we can see that the price close closely touched the green line that we drew okay we can see the volume pumped and now is decreasing we got the red bar right there so that led me to place this trade over here okay so instead of two minutes I then placed it for one minute okay so i've got another red bar over here this one is also dumping but it has a little bit of pump right there and uh, guess what it's pumping on this one over here i could have placed another trade again another entry over here but i missed it okay let me go ahead and place it right there so let's see how it goes we got 14 seconds on the first trades so we can see the volume it's um it's getting very very weak so it can be dangerous so i'm not going to place any more trades because um it, it's getting dangerous over here so we secure the first one so we got 38 seconds on the next one so let's see have a look over here we can see that yeah it is reacting so this one most likely is going to go up as well there you go so jpy is pumping so we're gonna keep an eye on that one so potentially we're gonna place a higher position on jpy instead of going low because the volume is there so let me see if i can get a better entry over here on this one so let's see if it comes closer to the 7 sma so we're gonna lose the second or the third trade over here so let's see where the price is okay we lost that one yeah jpy is pumping right so because um, we are looking at two jpy pairs you know that's showing that uh price is pumping okay so let's pause it and let's look for the next one okay just send a screenshot for this one over here so i'm just looking to see if the price is going to pull back a bit a little bit more close come closer to the 7 sma so we can place a higher entry over here because we can see the volume is getting green we had this slight pullback and now it's pumping back up again and this is card jpy jpy is pumping so um i'm willing to go ahead 
and place a trade on this one but at the same time we are reaching the over overbought level so we got to be careful we can see that this candle over here is smaller than the previous one so yeah we got to be careful so potentially we're going to have some sideways movement before the price actually cranks to the upside all right so in that case i'm going to hold on to these trades and uh, let's see what happens okay guys we have the another trade let me just send a screenshot i forgot to send a screenshot of this one okay we have another trade going on this one right here so we got 29 seconds to go and uh, we can see that we have some bullish momentum right here some green bars so that's a good indication but i felt like i came in a bit later i entered a little bit late on this one but i was like let me just give it a try so i, I was ready to put 2.5 but i was like maybe i'm gonna be too late so let me just risk one percent and let's see how it's gonna play out and uh, three seconds we got it cool so let's look for the next one okay this is the first trade that we ever placed and we can see that the price uh reached the green line as you could see right here and finally decided to prank to the downside all right so finally so i just placed two trades right there so i'm gonna place another one uh we can see the momentum is turning red all right so hence me placing these um lower entries right there okay so let's see how the price gonna how this trade is gonna develop. So we got 26 seconds on the first trade and 44 on the last trade. All right. So this green candle is not good for us, but the momentum still bearish. Okay. So hopefully price gonna continue to push down so we can clear this first trade, second trade, and third trade. Okay. We need to get these trades done. All right. So price is in two minds so we got two seconds uh we broke even on the first one two seconds uh ah, we got burned on this candle right here mm, we got the crossover and the stochastic and i don't like these dodgy candles okay so usually that's a sign that the trend is reversing so uh, i'm gonna hold on and see what's gonna happen so we won that one unfortunately we got burned on that one we broke even so we didn't make much money on this trade so let's see how the price is going to develop we can see that we still have some bearish momentum right there so let's see if the price goes up a little bit more so we can enter again because i strongly believe the price will go down it's just a matter of time okay because we can see over here these red bars they are bearish all right so we got some two dodgy candles over here and the price is moving too much around this area I'm, I'm i want to place another trade but at the same time um okay seems like price is cranking down okay let's go place another trade right there so let's see how this trade trade is going to develop okay at the same time we're still down because we started with uh 186 yeah 186 right now we are 182 so if you run this one we're going to be at 185 and uh, we're still going to be down ah i missed a good uh entry mm. let me go for another um lower entry right here so let's see how it goes and if i lose this one i will have to go to 2.5 let's see how this kind of develop so we got 14 seconds on the first trade hmm we still got bearish momentum but uh, this chart right here uh, is getting too crazy so i'm not going to place any more trades on this one because it's getting too wild right so it's going down but uh, it's getting too choppy all right so when the chart gets too choppy you know avoid the choppy charts because you're just going to get burned because you got lots of wicks all right so market is indecisive all right sometimes it goes down sometimes it goes up so avoid that as you can see right here we want some we lose some but you know choppy markets avoid at by the all costs okay so let's see if we can clear this one so you can get, get the hell out of this trade we lost that one okay so let's look for the next one okay guys so just sent your signal on this one to go low all right so hence me placing a lower entry on this one right here second one right there 
So let's see how it goes. So if you go over to the two minute chart, we can see two red bars right there. We can see that the price is on a downtrend. So it's just a matter of time for us to um, clear these trades. But at the same time, we have this green candle right here, which is which I don't like it, right? So price is in too much right now. At the same time, look out for this one. Where is it? Uh, I will show you in a minute. So let's see how it goes. Price is in too much. Price really wants to push down. Volume is decreasing, so that's not good. So we got five seconds to go. Let's see how this one is going to go. The first one is going to be gone. Potentially the second one is going to be gone as well. So let's see. Hmm. Today seems like we're not having a good trading session. Seems like we're going to lose this one as well. Yeah, we lost it. Okay, let's try again. This time we're going to go for two minute trades. So we can let this trade develop. Okay, because I still believe that a price will go down. We haven't reached the oversold level yet. So we are in. Okay, so we placed one trade over here. So if the price pulls back a little bit more, we're going to place another trade. But next trade is going to be for one minute. Okay. And um, yeah, hopefully this one is going to be a winner because otherwise you're going to have to wrap this session up. All right. So this one right here, it's seen too much. It's taking its time. Oh, price um, is where we started. Oh, oh not again. JPY today is crazy. JPY today is crazy, guys. So let me just say, do not trade JPY. Don't trade JPY. Too crazy. Too crazy indeed. So, yeah. So I'm just going to wait for this trade to finish. And then um, from here, we not, we're we going to stay away from JPY because it's just getting too wild. All right. JPY is just getting too wild. And we got burned so many times with JPY. What happened here? We got burned so many times with JPY. So um, avoid JPY because it's it's too wild. All right. So because when you got trades uh, chart with too many wicks, you know it's very easy to get burned. Okay. So avoid JPY. So we got 20, 20 seconds on this one. Let's see how this one is going to close. So hopefully this one is going to be a profit one. And uh, we're going to be able to continue this trading session. Yeah, JPY today is just on fire. Crazy, right? Crazy weeks. But now the price is going down. So we're happy with that. So we got a win. So let's move on to the next. Okay, guys. So it seems like uh, we're going to see a reversal on this one because the volume is decreasing. So. Uh, potentially this one or the next one is going to be a dodgy candle and then from there we need to see a bullish uh, candle so we can place a higher entry right here okay guys so just send a signal uh, wait for the reversal right there okay so now we still haven't seen any green bar over here so we still have the bearish momentum um, so if we zoom out a little bit we can see that it's forming higher lows okay one there one there and this one potentially is going to be the third one keep in mind it hasn't touched this over here we reached the oversold level but we still got the bearish momentum okay this bar is equal to the previous one so that's a sign that the bearish momentum is decreasing but we on a 30 second chart we can see this red bar over here so potentially price will come down to this line before um, have a continuation to the upside. All right. So uh, six seconds on this candle. Let's see how this candle is going to play out. Potentially, price will go sideways for a bit, or maybe not. Maybe this is a good opportunity to place a lower entry. So let's see how it goes. Potentially, it's going to go down a little bit more before have a continuation to the upside so hence you know let's go ahead and place a trade right here and let's see how it's going to play out all right got 43 seconds on this one mm, yeah jpy is too crazy today guys do not touch jpy all right so we got 30 seconds so we still got some volume there let's go over to the two minute chart 
we can see okay the volume is increasing so potentially the price will break a little bit below this green line <clears throat> before continues to the upside because it's gaining volume again okay so we got 10 seconds so if you win this one you're going to make 746 so you're going to be it's still going to be down a little bit okay uh we're still going to be down a little bit but um let's hope that we can make some money we can make some profits today so 178 we started with 186 so we're down eight bucks okay so let's go for the next one let me i'm gonna keep an eye on this one if i see the reversal then um we're gonna go up with this thing okay guys um we have the reverse potentially reversal right here so we got some uh, bullish momentum right there so i decided to place two minute trade right there but um kind of a bit weak right now so let's see how far this thing will go but that just realized that the payout has dropped from 60 something to 59 so now i'm like damn i'm already involved in this trade so i would like to place a few more trades because i believe that this one is going to go up but 59 percent payout is not that great all right so another thing that i would like to mention is jpy is pumping it's doing well jpi pay, payouts they are really good but like i said to you jpi is too crazy right now to go ahead with jpy jpy so i'm probably gonna wrap this session up because um not much is happening 59 percent payout is not great but hey ho you know um it is what it is right so this one is happening so hopefully we're going to be able to secure this one so let me flick this one to one minute because we can see the bullish momentum is here so let's see if we can place another trade uh, on this one so we can ride it up so let me see this one as well let me have go go like let me have a look at the two minute chart okay yeah so this one potentially is going to be a reversal as well and it's the same pair well similar pairs so let's have a look at this one so we got 10 seconds let's see how this one is going to go so is where the light Ooh, are we going to get burned or what four seconds we got it sweet okay so 181 uh we're still down five bucks okay so we just need just need to make a two trade or so but yeah today uh, is crazy jpy the payout the good payouts are with jpy but jpi is too too wild so i'm staying away from jpy so let me have a look one two so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so twelve so we lost um one two three four five six seven trades already okay it's not great because usually we make ten uh seven seven out of ten okay so usually we make seven out of ten so uh today we're not having a good day but seems like this one is not going to have a continuation to the upside let's go down with this one and uh, let's see how this one's going to take us because yeah seems like this one um fail to have a continuation to the upside so potentially we'll have a continuation to the downside this was a little bit rush trade because i just saw these two red bars candles but i was like okay let's go ahead and let's see where these um, trades will take us okay we can see the it was over bots we can see that volume is decreasing so i'm just looking to see if the price is going to go down or not if not well we're just going to call it a day okay because uh we're going to reach our eight percent loss price is not going to go down unfortunately and uh, we got seven seconds on these trades five seconds and uh whew, that was a close very close one hmm let's go six percent because we can see the bearish momentum right there let's see how it goes i'm i'm rich i'm going over the limit right now but uh, i'm like 
man, screw it. Okay, because everything indicates that the price will go down or was indicating the price would go down. Now price is going up. So we got the red bar right there. Okay, cool. I like that. But at the same time, candles are getting very weak. So that's not a good sign. So potentially this is just a small pullback before the price have a continuation to the upside. So let's see how this one is going to play out. So we got 25 seconds to go. Not much volume, not much is happening over here. So potentially this is going to be another loss. And that's it. We're going to wrap this video up because it's not going well in our favor. Okay, so this one, okay, this one looks good. Let's go ahead and this one. Okay, that one was a loss. Let's see how this one's going to play out. So we got three trades going on. Seems like I'm going to blow up my account. Everything looks bearish. So let's see how it goes. Everything looks bearish. So hopefully these three trades are going to be good. And uh, yeah, we're going to be able to wrap this session in big. Hopefully, fingers crossed, right? Because we got the bearish momentum right there. We got some red bars over here. Seems like the first one, we are a break even point right now. Let's see how it goes. Another red candle, break even point. Three seconds. We broke even on that one. Seven seconds. Ah, man. We're going to break even on this one, too. Okay. We got that one. So five seconds. Okay, 180. All right, guys. Unfortunately, this one we broke even. Otherwise, uh, we would be about one buck profit. Okay, one dollar profit. But yes, uh, today's been a crazy session. Ooh, lucky I didn't place any more trades. But the, 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 the volume is still bearish right there. Okay. Yeah, today's been a crazy session. JPY screwed us over many times. This one is not doing much. This one, the volume is very okay. Was it this one? Yeah, this one, I thought it would go down, but the volume is very, very weak. We just paid this one, the payout decreased to 64%. So not much is happening. JPY is where the money, the money is, but at the same time, we got burned so many times that I, today I'm just like, I'm not going to touch JPY no more. So this one right here is doing some strange things. And again, JPY, 80% looks good. But again, we got burned so many times with JPY that I'm not going to place any more trades with JPY for today. So it seems like today I'm going to call it another JPY. I'm going to call it a loss. All right, so we lost six bucks today. Uh, it's been a crazy session. And uh, yeah, I don't want to be uh, over trading and losing my trading focus because of um, uh, six bucks, okay? So um, unfortunately, I'm gonna close this session as a loss, six bucks, but uh, we managed to recoup some funds with those final three trades right there. Okay, so this one, where is it? Okay, it's pumping now. It's pumping now. What the hell? It's pumping now. Let's go over to the two minute chart. Okay, we can see the volume is there. Okay, the volume is there. Ah, oh, man. Should I wrap this session up or not? Uh, uh. Ah, I'm in two minds right now. I'm in two minds. But yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it a day because, um, okay, this one is. Let's have a look. The signal is bearish. We are a downtrend. And uh, we can see lots of um, dodgy candles right there. So potentially this one or the next one is going to be another red candle. Okay, this one looks interesting. Looks very interesting. We got a bearish candle over here. Let me change this to 1%. Don't forget. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm, I'm tempted. This one also looks good. Seems like uh, finally it's gaining the momentum to go up. 
Where is the other one? It's right here. Yeah, this one looks interesting. And the payout is 75% right now. Mm, another red candle. Yeah, seems like this one is going to go down. Yeah, this one is no longer a dodgy candle. Okay, I'm tempted to place a few trades on this one. So we're going to go for two minutes. Yeah, and uh, yeah, those um, three trades that I'm going to place. Well, if the price goes up a little bit more, okay, right there. Okay, and uh, if it goes up a little bit more, I'm going to place another one, and that's it. And uh, if you lose this trade, we either we win or lose these trades, I'm going to wrap this session up, okay, guys? Because um, what time is it now? 19.37, right? So let's just see how this uh, trading session is going to develop. So we got 1 minute and 38 seconds. Still want to place one more trade, and then, um, yeah, we're going to call it a day. If you got it, if I get a chance, hopefully not. Hopefully, price will, get, will continue to push down, and uh, we clear these two trades that we got going on. Maybe two minutes was too, a bit too long, and um, let's see, let's see how it goes. Everything indicates that the price um, is bearish. Everything is bearish, right? So hopefully, price will keep pushing down so we can clear these two trades. So we got 50 seconds on the first one. And one minute on the second one. And we are breaking even on the first trade. We got a green candle right here, which is not great for our scenario. This candle is very small. Hopefully, price will keep pushing down. And we got green bars over here, surprisingly, even though we got going down. Maybe uh, sometimes the momentum has a, a bit, uh, a few delays, okay? So, 25 seconds. Okay, so if we score these two, we're going to only lose three bucks, okay? Which I'm pleased with that, right? Let's see how it goes. Ten seconds, final stretch. Final stretch. So we got three points away, five points away. Ooh, no. We broke even. We broke even. God damn it. We broke even. God damn it. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap this video, this session up because uh, it's too wild today. All right, guys. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned in for the next one. Peace.